Hey, what's up, everyone? This is Rick from Tack Hill. Today, uh, I want to go over a new sheath that I got for one of my knives. Uh, this is a major shout out to Country Prepper, uh, also known as CP Kydex, guy by the name of Jeremiah. I had contacted him through Facebook. I knew of the channel Country Prepper, but I did not know of uh, his business, CP Kydex. And, uh, I found it and contacted him and I told him, you know, that I really like your work. It, it seems really nice and I'd like to order a sheath for you, from you, um, for one of my knives. So, uh, through talking back and forth with him, uh, he said, yeah, go ahead and send it to me and, and I'll make you one. Uh, all in all, awesome guy, nice guy, um, uh, pleasure to deal with. That being said... Check out this amazing sheath. Now that is beauty. That's it. That's beauty, bro. You're you're awesome. Look at that thick leather. That is gorgeous. It's a dangler system. Has a D ring. It's beautiful. The way he has this attention to detail. He gives these really great attention to detail. Now I sent him my ferro rod and he made ferro rod holder for it. It's the Coglins ferro rod. He also glued it back down for me because these apparently are cheap and they come off real easy. You can see there. Look at that ferro holder. Awesome. Look at that. It's just amazing attention to detail all the way across. Look at that thumb. Look at that. That's that's beautiful. I mean, he did a, a, a superb job. I am incredibly happy. This is the uh, the Buck Reaper, by the way. Um, when I bought this knife, it was black. I went ahead and stripped it down. Let's see if I can get some of the glare off of it. Buck, and then you can see here. Oop, that's kind of hard to see. Let's see if we can, there we go. 620 USA. Really good knife. When I first got it, the... Uh, the blade was a little off, so I had to kind of reprofile the blade, and then I decided that I was going to strip it and uh, cut these lanyard holes out through the handles because it actually has lanyard holes on the uh, the frame of the blade, but it was not on the handle scale, so I went ahead and did that. But this is not about this knife. This is about this awesome sheath. Now, he had made a video about this sheath, and in the video, he showed what his opinions are as far as color schemes go. Um, I think the next time I have him make a sheath for me, uh, I'm going to let him choose the colors that he wants and just let him go with it because he has... Uh, th this guy's an artist, man. He's really, really good. I would definitely recommend uh, purchasing a sheath from him for any knife that you have. This this guy is just, he's awesome. Now I did have to send in my knife because he did not have this particular knife. And that's fine. I mean, that's fine. I had no problems with that. You can see here, great retention, no rattle to it. I mean, it's nice. I like it. I like it a lot, man. You're, you're really awesome, Jeremiah. So this is going out to you, bro. Um, highly recommend giving this guy a shout out. Get to him. Have him make you a sheath. He's awesome. And uh, I'm very pleased. Very pleased. His name is Jeremiah. He goes by the YouTube channel Country Prepper. Also, the YouTube channel CP Kydex. Check him out. Guy's awesome. Big thumbs up. Thanks again. You guys have a great day. And I'll see you on the next one.